new computer science students really overthink stacks. They're just about the easiest data structure to learn though, so honestly, don't stress about it. Imagine you're at a salad bar, but before you load up on bacon bits and croutons, you need a plate. Now, it's a self-serve situation, and you notice a giant stack of plates sitting on the counter. Do you grab one from the bottom? The middle? No, because you're not a complete idiot. You grab one off the top of the stack. Okay, but here's the thing. You're with your romantic partner, who you're out to dinner with, and they explain they have to leave, and you decide you just don't even want salad anymore. So do you lift the giant stack of plates and shove your plate back at the bottom? Stuff it into the middle? Again, no, you're actually a sane human being, so you just set the plate back on top of the stack. And that's it. That's how stack data structures work. You put items onto the top of the stack, one at a time, and then you remove them off the top again, one at a time. Once something has been pushed down to the very bottom of the stack, you actually have to take everything else off the top before you can get down to it. Stacks are last in, first out. LIFO. That makes them restrictive, but useful in specific situations where you're okay with that limitation. For example, undo or redo in a word processor, or the back button in your browser history. Those are real world examples that actually use stacks under the hood. And the real benefit of stacks is that they're super fast. Pushing and popping items onto a stack are both order one operations.